All right, guys, welcome to a brand new video and MIUI 14 is around the corner and in China, it's going to be launching on the 1st of December along with the 13 series of devices. Now, Xiaomi have recently released a link in which you can go ahead and register yourself for the beta testing. That means you will have first access to these early beta or alpha builds, but the registration process is quite tricky and that's the reason I thought we should really, really make this video. Now, stay till the end of the video because the requirements are quite stringent and there is a way around it. So I'll share all the information with you. But before we get into the details, if you haven't already, please subscribe because it doesn't cost you anything and it really motivates us to make amazing content like this. Now, without further ado, hello, awesome people. Welcome to Phone Ops. My name is Kalash. Let's get going. All right, now let's first talk about the requirements. First requirement, you should be on a China ROM of your device because the website will detect if you're using a Chinese variant of the phone or not. And if you're not, then it will not work. Second requirement, you need to have a specific version of MI browser, a specific version of MI community. The links for both these applications are in the description and you need to have turbo VPN because remember a lot of Chinese websites are banned in India, including MI community. Now, once all of this is taken care of, you need to have a MI account with the avatar. That means, you know, the DP or display picture, you should have that updated. Now, once all of that is taken care of, you should be good to go. And now I'm going to show you how to do that. So one by one, first, you can go to the Play Store and install the easiest of the lot that is Turbo VPN. Now, while this is installing, I hope you've downloaded the two APKs that I mentioned. So let's go to the file manager. Now, as you can see, there are two APKs over here. One is the MI browser and one is the community. One by one, we will install both of them. And the ROM that I'm running on the Mi 11X right now is Abix ROG. Luckily, it is based on, you know, Xiaomi 12 Pro's China ROM. So it detects the phone as a Redmi K40. Now you can, of course, skip all this hassle. And if you have unlocked bootloader, whenever these MIUI 14 ROMs leak, you can try to flash them from TWRP and you should be good to go. But you know, for the kicks, you can definitely go ahead and try it. It's not that difficult. And especially when I'm guiding you, things should be much, much easier, right? Now this app is installed. So install MI community preparing for installation. I don't know why a 870 powered device has to take this much time, but uh, we are almost there. Okay, let's click on install. All right, so both the apps are installed as you can see. Now, before we proceed, first thing to make sure is that you are signed into your MI account. As you can see, this is my MI account number and uh, we'll ignore this update for now. Okay, so once you're signed in and Turbo VPN is installed, launch Turbo VPN and agree and allow. Now skip the advertisement that you get over here to upgrade and all and just click on connect. It will connect probably to a US server, which is what we need, hit okay. All right, now there is a link in the description which you need to copy and paste in the MI browser. Okay, so hit agree. If it asks you default, it's up to you. I can say yes. Click over here and long press to paste the link. This is the link, so hit go, okay. We are on the track. Now remember we are connected to VPN, so things will be slow. You have to be patient and it's still loading. Ideally, if it were a website that is allowed, it will load instantly because we have really, really fast internet over here. Now you will reach this screen. So click on this button here, hit accept. Once you've signed in, hit agree. Okay, let's see. Now, once again, you may see a white blank screen for some time. So please be patient because it will take you to a certain page. Remember VPN. Now, this is the page we should be looking for. And this is where it is asking you to sign in. So hit I agree, sign in. Okay, now it is detecting my device as a Redmi K40. I tried doing this earlier on the Redmi Note 10 Pro with the global ROM, it did not work. So now, accept the agreement over here. It will load once again. So nothing to panic, just be patient, hold on. Now, once you hit the agreement button and click on that button, it will take you to this particular screen. That means your registration is done. So you can just skip that part. There is nothing different over here. You will just get a prompt at the bottom that your registration is done. And of course it will be in Chinese. So there is nothing to worry. You won't get any sort of email or anything. You can actually use Google Lens to translate this page and it will say that the registration is done. Now, this is a pretty simple process and step-by-step -step guide. All the APKs and links are mentioned in the description. Now, don't expect that first December, you know, the beta is out and immediately your phone will get it. If you're on a China ROM, which says Redmi, 
AK-40, you will, if you're shortlisted, you will probably get the update. But all in all, MIUI 14 should be very exciting. Let's see how many devices get it with Android 13 and what the betas actually look like. Until the next one, stay tuned and keep smiling. My name is Kailash. Goodbye.